Пару секунд синий Есть пуск. Портовое питание. The second umbilical now retracting and the engine sequence start has begun. The uh, turbo pumps now up to flight speed, counting down to liftoff. Engines at maximum thrust. And liftoff. Liftoff of the 66th Progress Resupply Vehicle outbound to the International Space Station. Good roll pitch and yaw program reported from the blockhouse at Baikonur. The first stage engines uh, operating normally. Vehicle is stable. Good engine performance reported from Baikonur. Good yaw pitch and roll program reported. Seventy-three seconds into the flight, everything reported to be operating normally on the Soyuz booster. Eighty seconds. All booster parameters and onboard systems are nominal. Ninety seconds. First stage thrusters operate nominal. One minute, 40 seconds into the flight, everything uh, proceeding normally with the first stage performance of the Soyuz U booster. The first stage uh, separation, the four strap-on boosters separating uh, coming up uh, just seconds from now. And we have a booster separation. First stage separation reported, everything uh, proceeding nominally. The uh, Soyuz uh, booster now 30 miles in altitude, 73 miles downrange from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, traveling almost 4,000 miles an hour. Other than 40 seconds, uh, all the onboard and systems and booster parameters are normal. The uh, next major milestone will be the jettisoning of the launch shroud. And the launch shroud has been jettisoned. Two minutes, 41 seconds into the flight. All the vehicle structures and all the uh, structural parameters are reported to be normal. Three minutes, 15 seconds into the flight. Into the flight the second stage thruster is operating nominal. Repeating exact launch time, 0858. The second stage engine is firing normally. 210 seconds into the flight, all booster parameters and onboard systems are nominal. Second stage shutdown will occur at the four minute, 45 second mark into the flight. Just over a minute from now. Seconds, the, vehicle is stable. the vehicle is stable. As we approach the four minute mark into the flight, nothing but good reports so far from the blockhouse in Baikonur. Your pitch and roll program are perfect. So far, the Soyuz is dead on. Flying straight as an arrow, everything in good shape. Four minutes, 15 seconds into the flight. And systems are nominal. 270 seconds, all parameters of the booster rocket is nominal.
4 minutes 38 seconds into the flight. We have second stage separation. The third stage. The second stage separating at uh, 104 miles in altitude, 179 miles downrange. Uh, the Soyuz and uh, the Progress traveling almost 7,500 miles an hour. The third stage engine up and running. This uh, burn of the third stage engine about four minutes in duration. Good vehicle stabilization reported. Three hundred and twenty seconds. All booster parameters and onboard systems are normal. Three hundred and thirty seconds. The third stage thruster operates uh, normal. Third stage engine continues uh, to burn normally at the uh, five minute 40 second mark into the flight. Just over three minutes of powered flight remaining. 350 seconds, all nominal. Three hundred and sixty seconds, your pitch roll parameters are normal. The international fleet of supply vehicles uh, that started a couple of months ago uh, with the launch of the HTV, the White Stork, now the Progress, the SpaceX Dragon uh, soon to arrive at the International Space Station, the flotilla of resupply craft uh, heading for the station, six minutes, 15 seconds into the flight, about uh, two and a half minutes left in powered flight. 390 seconds. All uh, booster control parameters are normal. 400 seconds, vehicle stable. Everything's stable on uh, the Soyuz booster, the Progress resupply craft uh, riding on top of the third stage. As we are now six minutes, 45 seconds into the flight with two minutes of powered flight remaining. 420 seconds, your pitch roll. Yeah. Good yaw pitch and roll program reported. Vehicle stability is excellent. 430 seconds. Third stage thrusters operate normally. 440 seconds. The vehicle is stable. Seven minutes, 15 seconds into the flight. Uh, the third stage continues to operate normally, sending the progress to its preliminary orbit. Uh, structure parameters and the booster parameters are all nominal. Booster parameters are normal, according uh, to the flight control team, uh, both in Baikonur and at the uh, Russian Mission Control uh, Center. Booster performing nominally. Approaching the eight-minute mark into the flight, less than a minute of powered flight remaining. 480, all parameters nominal. Four hundred and ninety. The uh, stability is nominal. Five hundred seconds. Uh, the eight minutes, fifteen seconds into the flight, everything continues uh, to be very, very normal on board uh, the Soyuz booster. No issues reported so far. Your enroll parameters. The final few seconds now of powered flight. 520 control parameters nominal. 500 we have third stage shutdown third stage and third stage separation. separation the progress is now in its preliminary orbit, standing by for array and antenna deploy. The report is over. And uh, reports uh, now being received from uh, the Russian Mission Control Center that the Progress has deployed all of its navigational antennas and its solar arrays. So the Progress has uh, ridden a true Soyuz U uh, on a perfect launch from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. An 8 minute 46 second ride from the launch pad at Baikonur to its preliminary orbit. The Progress now on its way 
beginning a two-day rendezvous to reach the International Space Station for an automated docking in the early morning hours Central Time on Friday, docking scheduled at 2.34 a.m. Central Time. And uh, this view from uh, the black and white uh, engineering camera on the outside of the Progress vehicle as it uh, begins its journey to the International Space Station. Again, uh, liftoff occurring right on time at uh, 11.58 and 33 seconds p.m. Central Time, 12.58 and 33 seconds a.m. Eastern Time, which was two minutes before noon at the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. The Soyuz U booster lifted off. Uh, all of its operation for all three stages was perfectly That's normal. Right. Eight minutes and 46 okay. seconds okay. after launch, uh, the third stage shut down and uh, the Progress separated from the third stage and immediately deployed its antennas and solar arrays as planned as it begins its two-day journey to the International Space Station. At this point, uh, the CORE's automated rendezvous system on the Progress is going through uh, what is called a self-test, uh, a preliminary test of its systems uh, to make sure it is operating. Uh, that will be the guidance for the Progress during the terminal stage of uh, the rendezvous uh, that on Friday morning uh, that uh, will lead the Progress to a link-up to the Piers docking compartment on the Earth-facing side of the Russian segment of the International Space Station.